Okay, now I'm measuring the oil clearance for the for the first, fifth, and uh, reverse gears. And uh, we have to use a dial indicator for this. We place we place the the gear through the side, very softly on the legs, just to hold it. Okay, I'm now measuring the, um, the oil clearance for the gears, between the gears and the race. Uh, you have to do this with the bearing installed. And you use your dial indicator over the race and see how much it moves when you try to move the race up and down. Um, in this case, the, the movement should not be 0.15 millimeter. When you try to move, this is used to uh, measure any any um, defects in the bearing. Uh, in this case, the the movement is very very slight. As you can see, the needle barely moves, so I don't have any any problem in this in this bearing. Now for the reverse gear, you can see it moving. It's like Maximum clearance is 0 0.1. This one is moving quite a lot. It's like a 0 0.1 millimeter tolerance here. So I think it's within limit, and uh, any difference in this would be that maybe the reverse gear would, would whine. The bearing and since we only use the reverse gear so so much I won't be any doing anything about this. Now measuring the clearance for the third gear we have to place it on the on the main shaft and uh, place your uh, dial indicator on the on the gear. You move it up and down you see it's like 0 0.1 millimeter clearance here. The maximum for this gear is 2, 0 0.2, so in order for it to be broken, it should be, it should go over that one, that dial there. Now, as for the, for measuring the clearance for the second gear, you have to insert the, the second gear into its place. I recommend that you put some gear oil in here. Just a little bit. So that the bearing is always lubricated. And now for the gear, do the same for the inside of the gear. synchronizer so well now as for the second gear clearance you see that the needle barely moves so it's well within tolerance the maximum tolerance is 0 0.15 millimeters and uh, we have a tolerance of approximately 0 0.004 millimeters so this gear is very good as well as the bearing the, the, this bearing is very good 